Hello everyone and a very good uh, morning on this uh, nice Sunday. Uh, it's a bit chilly in here at the minute. I've got my patio heater on just to get it warm in here and then I can make a start on the uh, Titanic again. I'm uh, doing the rigging today. Well, what I had to do first, I had to uh, take some photographs of the other one that's upstairs, the wooden one, to sh so I know where the rigging's going, because I completely forgot. Because like with this uh, trumpeter kit, uh, no instructions came with for the rigging, only for the build. So with all that said now, let's make a start on doing all this. Sorry about that, so I forgot to press record. Okay, I'm all set now. Um, I've put my first part here. I know it's very hard to see. Uh, let's move this light back a bit. Just this part here coming down so I just need to tie that off into a knot and this is going to be the worst part that's going to need me a tablet because I'll show you what I've done took a photograph of the other Titanic for the rigging in different angles and I need to get this exact. I'm, I'm sorry I didn't keep the box now. Because that had everything I needed. Sorry. Uh, what it was on the wooden model, they had a piece coming along gear round here with a hook on it. But that, the ship didn't have that anyway, so. Couldn't do it. I'll just move it over like so. So this is going to be the hard part now. Well, I won't do it. I think that there. Yeah. Wondering where my tweezers were. Even the ladders keep coming off. It might be the cold. I don't know. So. Just knock that up. Like that, gently. I'll put a double of glue on it, just a tiny bit. So it doesn't come undone. So all it needed just a little bit of bowl. That's perfect. So what I'll do, I'll just let that dry. And there's another hook here. I should have put these ladders on last, to be honest. Uh, let's just see where that goes. That's all. Okay, let's 
over there. Now here comes the fun part, is getting the string Actually, what we'll do, we'll put, put it through the hole first glasses off so I can see what I'm not doing. A little bit of a wet. And cut off the little bits at the end here. Alright, 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 alright. Which one was it now on this one? through give it a long excess uh, give this long excess very long excess it's better to do overdo the the rigging they're not having enough on at all, so put this through here like that and now I'm going to put it over the uh, what's it here even though it, probably on the ship it didn't go there but I've got nowhere else to put it so I'll put it on the inside inside one through again little dab of glue so it'll come out that's not going to move again and pull this around like that so I need to get it on the inside of this one here Do. Let's come down here. 
hate it turn, when it turns into a figure eight. Tweezers. Sorry if my arm's in the way, but I need to get this in here. Just doesn't want to go in. This is the difficult part. Oh, I didn't get that. Right. What I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to loosen this. Bits because uh, it's a pity I haven't got any of that wire left. What I did the funnels with that I've probably made it a damn sight easier. So all I need to do is just to get this. So if I just pull this down a touch oh, I need some more light and the bulb's gone on here uh, uh, let's see I'm just going to pause the hit for a minute guys because I'm really struggling here. Just bear with me a minute. Okay that took me 20 minutes to get that part on. So I'm going to cut the excess off here now. I'm use my sprue cutters to get inside there to make it get it as close as it can. Like so, I'll just leave that one to dry. Okay. 
So I need some string now to go through this hole here and on onto the crane. here oh no it wasn't it was up here to there and then oh, this has come loose again to so go around that to so come down from the top down here and back up that way and that one yeah but the holes are very tiny on this so I don't think I'm gonna be able to get the thread through them I don't think to do is to tie the string round this to come down here to come back up and then cut that off and then that one wherever that goes so I'll just check my fault up just from up there down there and back up okay I didn't really want to tie it round the mass but I have no option like so put a bit of glue on it let that stick and I don't want it to bring it down too tight because it could break So it's got to go on here, right there. Let's see if we can put a loop on it. Give myself a bit of excess. Do 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 like so and it's not done anything <laughs> it 
through that like so. Huh. Managed it. Make sure it's not too tight. Nope. Dab a bit. I'll go in there. Only a little teeny weeny bit. Just keep it taut. And then bring it up to there. Like that. So I'll just let that. That's all I really need to let it dry. Let it stick. Just quick drain the uh, glue so I can carry on. So I need to get it through this hole up here. And tie it off. sewing needle You always get that little piece that hangs off the cotton. Got it. Now then. I've got it through a bit. Where's my tweezers? it through a bit more. Like so. Okay. it off there I don't really need a lot of excess and then So, and just add a bit of glue. Let that set. Yeah. 
I don't know if you can see that string on there but it's pretty hard to see unless I put the camera down here so you can see it there the rigging <laughs> right there okay. well, I'm just gonna have a quick break before I uh, start again while I've just been having a rest I've uh, done two of these to go down in between the masts because I didn't get any with them so I'll cut these two off a of sprue and that's put file it uh, sand it down a bit and then put them together so I could uh, get the, the holes in the right place this is going to be the fun part to do for the Marconi wireless. Um, it sh should be all right, but I'm going to be painting them first and um, and then attach them onto the uh, ship. It's going to be all fingers and thumbs, more like more thumbs and fingers, to be honest. And I know it's they're a lot bigger than the normal one, but I wanted to keep the wires uh, far away from each po each other as possible, so they don't get tangled. Because, like, uh, how was I going to put this? It's going to be like a, a triangle coming out from the uh, mast going into the the two outer sides and going down the outer ship so they're like that far away from each other as possible it's going to be the full length of the ship well in between the two masts anyway so I'll get that done after well once they've been painted then I can put them on but for the time being I'm still doing the, uh, the rigging and it's not looking that bad actually considering the problem i had before trying to get get the uh the cotton round that um capstan even though they weren't they didn't go around it but there's nowhere else to put it so yeah so let's just carry on All I'm going to have to do now is going to put rigging, I keep catching my microphone and keeps falling off, put rigging from the top mass here and it's coming down into the deck here in front of this air vent. So I'll put that in first, add a bit of glue and I've had to turn the whole ship around, the whole base. Whoops a daisy. Everything seems to be falling over. So I'll be putting it in that hole just here. I think I'm going to have one of them days again where things don't go right. So I'll put that in there all the way in let's get me tweezers wherever I put them right here and this
gently put it down there as far as I can go. Get some glue. Oh, it's a bit awkward here. Put a bit there. Let that set while I, uh, because that, this cable's in the way here now, so there's not much I can do with that. Let's measure up what, how much you need. on the front that goes right at the top okay so I'll cut some excess off just to know how much you need say about there I'll let that dry for a second and then parts I just shown you before to go along in between both masts um, they've just been painted that should have dried nicely yep so what will do Because I can't get it through the small little holes because they're not wide enough. If you can see the mast. So what I'll do, I'll just cut off a bit more. Because it's too much on there. Say about there. That should be quite sufficient. So what I'll do, I'll put a loop on, do the loopy loop. Put it over. Turn it on like so, I'm not putting any uh, unnecessary unnecessary uh, tension on the string but just enough tension like that and what I'll do let's put it on here I'll just glue A little bit on it so it holds it in place and let that dry for a bit before I cut that off that's perfect let's move this excess because this might come in handy for something I don't know yet it's quite a fair quite a fair length of string yeah because it's yeah because it's got to go in the roof of this i'll just show you it's got to go into there so what i'll do i'll just drill the hole wherever i put me a pin vise so i'll drill the hole which is just there And sorry about the dogs. But they do but they do bark at anything. So what I'll do here is put a loop on this. Put it down there on the, that one. So 
so goes on. So these dogs are doing my head in. I need to measure how much I need to go in there. I'd say don't need a lot. guessing at it until I decide how much you need. And it, now this part is getting uh, the cotton in, pulling it through. Probably may still need to cut some off. Yeah, I still need to cut some more off. Say about there. Say about here. I did have some ringlets but I don't know where they went and loads left Say about like that part. I've a dab of glue. Uh, I breathed on it and it's moved it. I really need to find some ringlets that would be easier. I think that's the best I'm going to get it, to be honest. Yeah, that's better. Put the glue on. Put the glue in. Let's see if I can still pull it down. No. So that's on. So now I can cut the excess off here. And here. And it's moved. I knew it'd move.
And to be honest with you, I need a ringlet. It's not easy doing this, to be honest. Oh, stick it to the sit now. I need to find them ringlets. It's not gonna work. I literally had a bag full. So you want to put something down? It's all coming loose. not going to work. It's even sticking to me tweezers. And yet the one at the front stayed in. It's a bit tart. So, try 
bit of old glue. Managed to sort that out. <coughs> now what I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that to dry. Well to stick. <coughs> I don't wanna touch it yet. Do any more yet. Uh, so what I'll do, I'll finish this video now and give that time to stick. And if it doesn't work then I'll uh, figure something out. Well, that was a bit of a pain. I'm going to do, once that's dry, I'm going to do another video after this and uh, to carry on. And hopefully, I might be able to get the top done as well. I mean I put them two pieces which I'll just show you one there and one there they're just drying, they should be dry now anyway uh, yeah it looks like they are yeah they, uh, they look dry enough with the four holes in them Whatever, but I'll, I'll just let them dry a bit longer so so I'll, I'll do another video after this and uh, get some more done because I'm going to be in here all day doing this all day uh, what time is it now it's 20 to 11 now and uh, carry on from there yeah so if you like this video please give it a massive thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribed please do so and don't forget to hit that notification bell for future videos. So until after guys, you all stay safe and take care. Bye for now.